I'm Joseph Alpert, and I'm Editor-in-Chief of the American Journal of Medicine, and I'm here today to call your attention to what I found to be a really interesting article. As many of you know, there's been a tremendous amount of debate back and forth about diets and, and uh, atherosclerotic disease, both in the cerebral circulation, the heart, and, and the periphery. Uh, I know recently the Annals of Internal Medicine published a very controversial meta-analysis from a very good group at uh, McMaster University saying that maybe meat wasn't such a high-risk uh, consumptive item uh, for the development of atherosclerosis. Well, here's another meta-analysis, um, this time on egg eating, and it showed that eating one egg a day did not put people um, at risk for atherosclerosis, but the interesting thing was that more than one egg a day actually was associated with a reduced risk of atherosclerosis. So the debate goes on, you know, yes, eat eggs, don't eat eggs. Yes, eat meat, don't eat meat. <clears throat> I, I think uh, uh, the most important thing that most studies of this area have shown is lots of fruits and vegetables and, and whole wheat uh, uh, products, whole grain products and nuts and, and so forth um, is a very good idea to have a lot in your diet. And it doesn't look like meat and eggs have, are, are so much of a risk as, as we once thought. Um, it's interesting, stay tuned because I'm sure there are going to be many, many more articles on diet and atherosclerotic heart disease. Thanks for reading the AJM and please stay in touch with us through our Facebook or, or our website.